Llama Llama Mother's Day Present, written by Anna Dudney. It is almost Mother's Day. All of Llama Llama's friends have made big plans to celebrate. Luna created a special card. Nellie planned a day outside. Gilroy is writing a song and Euclid is making an Eiffel Tower out of toothpicks. You all have such good ideas, Llama Llama says. I want to make my mama's Mother's Day amazing too. He decides to make mama a breakfast of all her favorite foods and bring it to her in bed. His friends agree this is a great idea. Llama Llama visits his grandparents. They help him practice making and serving pancakes. Breakfast in bed, says Llama Llama, presenting the plate to Grandma. Mmm, Grandma says, taking a bite. Delicious. Llama Llama tells them about the rest of his Mother's Day plans. First, Mama and I will build a fort, and then we'll go on the slip and slide, make pizzas, go to the playground, and it will be so fun, he says. Grandma Llama laughs. She points out that those are Llama Llama's favorite things, not Mama's. Llama Llama needs to come up with a new plan. The next day, Llama Llama sees his friends at school. He tells them about his secret mission to find out things his mother likes. If I watch and listen very closely, he explains, I'll know exactly what Mama wants for Mother's Day. Like a spy, says Gilroy Goat. Llama Llama's teacher, Zelda Zebra, has a special plan too. With Mother's Day coming up, she says, I have a class gift for us to create for your moms. She explains that they will be making a class quilt together, with each student designing their own square. Llama Llama and his friends get to work. When Llama Llama gets home that day, he follows his mother around the house. He listens to everything she says and looks for clues as to what she would like for Mother's Day. Some cut flowers would look so lovely right here, she says. I do like paddle games and lemonade and gardening, she continues. I love pancakes, she exclaims on the phone. Pancakes, Llama Llama whispers to himself. I knew it. Now he has lots of ideas for Mother's Day. The night before Mother's Day, Llama Llama sits on his bed and looks at his long list of activities. He has planned so many of Mama's favorite things to do. That's it, he tells his stuffed llama fuzzy. Every minute is filled up. It will be a perfect Mother's Day for Mama. Hey, where is she, Llama wonders. Llama Llama decides to check on Mama. He hops out of bed and quietly tiptoes downstairs. He overhears his mother on the phone again. Actually, I don't have any Mother's Day plans at all, she tells Mama New. A low-key, relaxing Mother's Day sounds pretty perfect. It does? gasps Llama Llama shocked. I'll be fine if we do nothing at all, Mama Llama continues. Llama Llama looks at his long list of activities. He doesn't know what to do. He crumples up his paper. The next day, Llama Llama sits at the kitchen table and colors with his stuffed llama. Remember, Fuzzy, he says, we can't make a big deal about Mother's Day. Mama Llama walks into the room with a big smile on her face. Good morning, my little llama, she says. Morning, says Llama Llama. Happy Mother's Day. Mama thinks Llama Llama is going to surprise her by making pancakes, but he just keeps on coloring instead. Mama Llama looks out the living room window. She watches Nellie and Mama New rollerblade down the street. She sees Luna give her mom a beautiful card. She hears Gilroy sing a special Mother's Day song. Looks like fun, says Llama Llama's mom. It does? Llama Llama replies, surprised. Mama, I had big plans too. He tells her what happened. Oh, Llama Llama, she replies. This is so sweet. I didn't know you had big plans for today. 
Mama Llama takes Llama Llama's hooves into her own. I'm a very lucky mama, she says. I love you, kiddo. I love you too, mama, Llama Llama replies. They share a big hug. Can we still do a few things on the list? Llama Llama asks. Mama Llama smiles and nods. Llama Llama jumps up and down. First, Llama Llama makes Mama breakfast in bed. Next, he brings her a big bouquet of flowers. Then, they swing together in the sunshine. There is still one more big Mother's Day surprise. Llama Llama and his mother meet all of their friends outside school. Happy Mother's Day, everyone, Zelda Zebra says, welcoming them. I'm here to present a very special gift from your children. She unfolds the quilt to reveal all of the special squares made by her students. Llama Llama Square is right on top. This is so beautiful, Mama Llama exclaims. I love it. She gives Llama Llama a big hug. Mama and Llama Llama press their noses together. Thank you, little Llama, for the best Mother's Day ever, Mama says. Llama Llama beams proudly. The day had turned out to be perfect after all. The end. This read aloud has been brought to you by Time to Read to Us. Hit the subscribe button for more kid friendly read alouds. Thanks for watching!